Have you heard about the flightless birds that have been taking off recently? Pudgy penguins, an NFT project that saw itself in a rough patch recently, seems to be picking up again, despite the so-called NFT winter. In this video, we are going to dive into the rise, fall, and redemption of pudgy penguins. Stick till the end to find out the penguin NFT that was sold for over $600,000 for, wait for it, simply looking the other way. But wait a minute, what are pudgy penguins NFTs anyway? Think PFPs like bored apes or crypto punks, but for cute and chubby penguins. The collection has 8,888 penguins that are unique and randomly generated from over 150 hand-drawn traits. Its launch came in the middle of the NFT bull run in 2021, and the timing couldn't be more perfect. In less than 20 minutes, the collection was sold out, and within a week, its floor price was as high as 2.4 Ether. Remember the superstar left-looking penguin we mentioned at the beginning of the video? In September 2021, a collector shelled out 225 Ether for it, an amount worth nearly $1 million at the time. To say that Pudgy Penguins had an impressive start is an understatement. Besides its success in the market, the project received a lot of attention from mainstream outlets like the New York Times, which featured it on its front page. With the amount of hype around it, you wouldn't be out of line if you suggested that the Penguins would surpass Bored Ape Yacht Club's floor price then. However, it was not long till things started spiraling downhill. In December 2021, came the first nail in the coffin. Some trouble in pudgy penguin paradise. When an issue arose between the founding team and one of the Discord mods, Darth, who is being promoted into a more formal community manager role. Darth expressed dissatisfaction with his compensation on Twitter and also accused the project leaders of trying to bribe him and equating him to a low-skilled worker who is not worthy of higher pay. The saga went on as the founders later launched their own Twitter space to do some damage control and try to minimize the fallout from the Darth situation. As expected, Penguin's floor price took a hit but shortly after recovered. However, the killer blow came on Christmas Day. Back in August, holders were airdropped a new NFT of an egg that would hatch on Christmas Day. There was a lot of speculation and excitement around the hatch, as no one knew what the NFT egg would contain. On December 25th, the eggs did indeed hatch, only to reveal fishing rods. The community felt like this was a massive letdown and was furious because all through, the founders were benefiting from royalties. To appease the angry community, they launched a Lil Pudgies collection, but the divide was clear. Eventually, talks between the Pudgy Penguins founders and a project whale that goes by 9x9xeth on Twitter surfaced, with 9x9x9 accusing the team of trying to unload the project to cash in on its success. The team subsequently drained the treasury and withdrew nearly 4,000 Ether in total to their personal Coinbase accounts. This was the final nail in the coffin. The community had had enough and held a public vote on Discord to oust the founders. Fast forward to April 2022, the project was handed a lifeline as the co-founders sold the collection and rights to a group led by Los Angeles entrepreneur Luca Schnetzler, a longtime fan of the project, for around $2.5 million. After the takeover, it seemed like Pudgy's long-awaited redemption arc was taking shape as the project's new leadership went all in on re-establishing the project. Since the April acquisition, Pudgy Penguins has launched its NFT marketplace, clothing and toy lines, a media hub, and grown its social media presence. Plus, the project introduced a star-packed nine-member advisory board, consisting of heavyweights such as Nansen's Alex Vanovic and Jordan Sterling, who work on Meta's venture capital partnerships team. These developments and a series of announcements were more than enough to kindle the ignition for Pudgy's recent takeoff. The floor price spiked in the recent month, and as of making this video, it sits at over 3 Ether. Pudgy's siblings, Lil Pudgies and Pudgy Rods, have also enjoyed similar success to their elder brother. As promised at the beginning of the video, here is the Pudgy Penguin that fetched over $600,000. This gray penguin looks plain compared to others, but is the only left-facing penguin 
making it the rarest in the collection. All things considered, Pudgy Penguin's journey so far has been a roller coaster ride, to say the least, but its comeback has been impressive. It seems the penguins are currently in good hands, with Luca Schnetzler driving more awareness and commercialization efforts at the driver's seat. Are we witnessing the birth of a new blue chip collection? Give us your thoughts in the comments section. Remember to like, subscribe, and follow us on all our socials for future alpha. See ya!